Yep. And it's going. So once again, my Pittsburgh puller set with my Maddox separator and my little adapters are saving me some money on getting these bearings off of these NV4500 shafts, specifically the lower counter shaft. The drum, I re fully recommend using a Dremel to cut that cage off with. I think, I don't know how I would have gotten a regular grinder in there without screwing the gear up. But as you can see, everything worked awesome. So I'll put full this lower part for you, all the parts I used and stuff. But, uh, you know, I've been using this manual, which is great. I put the links on there for this, this TM1003 uh, manual. And in here you can see they use a special tool. Uh, they even put the, it's a QT 2014 puller with a QT 2020 call it. All that stuff's pretty expensive. I'm on a budget. So that's why I'm putting this video up to kind of show you that there's a better, cheaper way to do this stuff. So, hope you enjoyed the video.